Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Old World Blues. I'm your host, Mr. Mokalover, and right now we are finishing up a focus for two sons called Standardized Spare Parts. Through the use of Standardized Spare Parts, we can effectively reduce the cost for production and maintenance maintenance of our small vehicles. And which right now, I asked you guys yesterday for the Hente del Sol question, which way we should go, but we'll get to there in just a little bit. Let's go and do some... Armored personal carriers. The rediscovered APC heralds the advent of mechanized warfare. Studying old schematics, we will soon be able to reconstruct this most fearsome of all armored transportation vehicles. Followed up with Thunderstruck. The mighty Kaiser has heard of our efforts and granted us use or access to old pre-war books on the topic of mechanized warfare. We shall make sure to study them in great detail, particularly the ideas of the Blitzkrieg. So if you like to read about traders from Hawaii, please go right ahead. Which I usually like to do the one on the right, even though we could use more manpower. I prefer political power overall. Not bad. And I do like, that we can see this, <clears throat> we're already assimilating refugees without even needing to do nationwide assimilation drives, which is actually very, very nice. I really like that one a lot. Uh, we can build new tracks. We're still trying to build up roads here, which means that we will be able to core stuff. It doesn't cost political power to core stuff, but we do need a lot of motorized equipment, and the state infrastructure level needs to be at least six, which is very odd. Very, very odd, but you know what? That's okay. And Ultimo, Saguar, oh, uh, you guys are told, oh, uh, no. Okay, so here's the deal. Once uh, these guys run out of manpower and they go to war with the NCR, we're probably going to have to defend against the NCR. It's going to be up to us. So let's get some more political power. Because we love PP and stability. Even though we could use some more war support as well. Do some comms to go through as well. But we do need some more army XP. That is not looking bueno, but thank you very much. Let's go grab some Thunderstruck. Followed up with what? Arms and supplies? Managed logistics? Why not? Actually, that's kind of unique. More supply grids for 12 hours? Not too bad. With the advent of mechanized infantry, logistics has grown increasingly complex. A motorized army can only travel as far as its fuel provides, which is why our support convoys are the lifeblood of our army. Pretty good. And no, Kaiza, I'm sorry, but I still don't think we want to come over. Well, wait, it's 2279. The brother just beat the cause? That's kind of late, isn't it? That's a little late. Actually, how much, how much manpower does the Mojave chapter still have? Thunder truck is very good to get them. Less than a thousand manpower, not too bad. I kind of don't want to see how much manpower, though, Kaiser's Legion doesn't have, so. Let's do this one. We'll get some more money. Oh, actually, we do want to finish up Armored Assault, and we'll do Rapid Motorized Deployment for more recovery rate, max speed, and 20% more reinforce rate. Not too shabby. Send Priest to Flagstaff. Our priests have managed to make great progress with the research, and it was time we share some of our discoveries with the rest of the Legion. While we cannot expect outright repayment, we are a mere subject after all. We may expect substantial financial gifts in the near future, and potentially even more blessings in the form of further exemptions. Nice. Beautiful. And we got some of this, which we might use. We'll see what happens. Um, this technology, uh, research stuff, salvaged cars. Are we supposed to have blueprints for this? I'm going to wait till we maybe have some more blueprints. We don't have much here. Industry, um... I still kind of want to wait. Let's grab that one first. Cool. We have so much PP though. We can build new tracks. What are we building? Ooh. We're building up a lot of roads, actually. Saguaro? Can we do that one yet? Yes, we can. Saguaro is done. Ultimo is not done yet, though. So, Ultimo. Um, that one can go down now. Over here, Ultimo. Alright, so we're doing both of these. I do want to get at least one more Civi first at the same time, so... Yeah, let's do Ultimo first. I think that'd be better to do overall. We can raise our conscription a little bit more, but we're kind of okay for now. Road Warrior. Uh, more attack defense. More, I don't want more caps expenses because we only have so much. Encryption would not be bad. Silent Partner. Less passive caps, but meh. Yeah, we'll go with more attack and defense probably. Actually, production policies. Regulated shack markets. Dolchinsky so we can make stuff a little bit faster. And send priests to Flagstaff. Follow up with the Henta del Sol question. Ah, let's go in a little bit. Desert tires. What is that? Settler automation. Huh. Okay. Faster. Car. Intermediate construction technology. Ooh. That's not bad. Desert tiles. Or optimizer design. Salvage gun truck. Um. Impact bumper. Salvage cars. Wasteland cars. Where's wasteland cars in this? Wasteland cars. Oh well, I guess we do get that. Salvage car. We need to do do need a blueprint for that one. So. Gun truck. Hmm. Well, arms and supplies. We'll do this naval stuff probably last. Uh, spearhead stuff. Oh, resources. Tank reliability. Tank... Ooh, that'd be really good. Uh, let's go ahead and do desert tiles. Oh, there's nothing here. There's no reading here. We get an arms workshop. That's it. Well, that kind of sucks. I, I would like to read some more stuff. Please, thank you. Ooh, we'll do a 35. Yeah, let's go ahead and spend up our army XP. We could militarize society, but... 
apply what we've learned. We're all prepared, and a lot of people are getting ready for the great race, which is very, very nice. And they're ready to kill off Hento del Sol. Overall, so like I did ask you guys yesterday, whether we should try to go to war with Hento del Sol, or we should do under the protection of the bull. And overall, there's more support for under the protection of the bull, because this is supposed to be historical, I think. As well as, it's just more support for it, period. So, as someone did say in the comments from the last video, basically two playthroughs are really needed to get through the full experience of two sun. Or two suns. Two sun. So, I would like to go down this way, but if we do a historical someday, we will go down that way, so maybe someday. Not today, but maybe someday. Chief of the Air Force, production cost goes down, why not? I'll just grab it anyways. Alright, not bad. Heavens get to play War Murtaugh. Unit training. Oh, okay, not bad. Guerrilla attack, this would be pretty good to do. We're so prepared and ill-prepared at the same time. So, Desert Tiles first, actually. There we go. And so, as I said, I think I think I said in the last video, too. Uh, try out the Cartels, because they actually have a dual, unique, focus tree sort of deal. So that's actually really cool to do. Let's do that one. And there goes the NCR, fighting the Brotherhood of Steel. Nice. <sighs> Guys, please. Please stop attacking. Please. Cool. More traders. Let's, let's get some more war support. Why not? Lose a little bit less. Actually, this costs even more, so let's do this one. We get some manpower and some money. Oh, they got plenty of ma enough manpower. That's actually not too bad. Raider Rumbles, huh? Specialized Warfare. Let's grab some of this too. Special Forces Expansion. Sign us up. Yes, please. Thank you. And after Desert tire Tires. Ora et Labora. Well, we'll do Henta question. Everything about the Generalissimo is a lie. His country, his path, his accomplishments, his peace and ambitions, even his title. We shall ask Flagstaff if we can truly trust such a man, especially if he claims to be our friend. Promising gifts. Tomeo... Donna Aos at Donna Florentes. Our loyal subjects and two sons have once again brought gifts to Flagstaff. Nice. Guys, they already took back Hoover Dam. Please. Please stop attacking. I, don't get me wrong. I love it when they attack you, but Jesus Christ, guys. Assimilation, making more money. Nice. Uh, we could probably actually start losing some manpower. I don't want to lose manpower. I mean political power. I mean political power. Actually, if we're at war, we could do this one, actually. That hurts our stability, but does give us a lot more daily autonomy. So there you go. We'll do it. A lot more autonomy. I wonder if we could actually become free. We might be able to. And we'll finish our land auction. Finish our land auction off with coordinated onslaught with more breakthrough, heart attack, and organization. Do we get any? We got 5% more soft attack. Is that it? Okay, no, we got 10% uh, total. Eh, still not great. But whatever. But whatever. Alright, so we'll do it under the protection of the bull. Like the roads that connect our land. So shall our alliances of Kaza connect the Legion as a whole. It was foolish of us to doubt the Generalissimo's intentions and profits from the trade caravan he sent already filling our coffers, perhaps in the future. We can seek out opportunities of even closer cooperation, which I will wait to do this one, just because we want to make sure that our trade note here in Tucson is as high as possible before we do that. Thank you. Oh, never mind, we're going to do it immediately, because it's already level 9. That costs a lot of PP too. Wow. And that's okay. We cannot do that one, though, which sucks, but... Um, I guess Kaiser has to approve of that. So if it's a historical, then that would have been okay. But hey, we get more uh, development to two suns. Nice. Followed up with the energy of the sun. Not bad. Naval dockyards. Get some energy, which is very good. Troll worn. Arms workshops would actually be very, very nice as well right now. So, joint arms production. The Generalissimo made us one simple promise guns, guns, and yet even more guns. We got one, two. We'll get a lot more motorized actually very soon, which is actually super crucial for us right now. So, oh, we can grow this. Look at that. It costs. 441. Okay, so actually, let's take a look. Let's cost 917 if we were able actually to do it. 917. So if we do this, will that cost go up if we core this? 414. 970. No, it does not. Actually, that's really cool. I like that. Can we core this yet, too? We're still building up our road a whole bunch. 613? No. Ah, I did go up by one, but. Coring cost. State's population. It's because of the population distance from the capital. Interesting. Okay. And anything else here? No, we're done with this side, which kind of sucks, I'll be honest. Airbase raids, you might as well. And actually, we, we don't have any dockyards. Oh, darn it. Um, well, how much money do we have, actually? 500 something? Let's ma start making an intelligence agency. So, let me know, guys, in the comments below. What name should we give our intelligence agency? Please let me know in the comments below what you believe would be a fitting name for Tucson or Tucson here. Please let me know in the comments below. Awesome. And joint armed productions. Very good. Very, very good. Refugees. Give us the refugees. We want to assimilate as many people as possible. We're going to become very strong here. Very, very strong. Um, let's see. Gauss rifles are own design. Yeah. 
Ooh, that'd be really good to Reclamation Authority, the old world secrets will be ours. Energy of the Suns. Our people have always preferred the sight of an open road over anything else. However, due to our newly formed bond with the people of Henta, we have come to view the rivers as what they truly are. Highways for resource transportation, which would get two dockyards. Naval base set to level 10, holy crap. 20 things of energy and 10 things of water. And Henta City, so not bad. Scavenger vehicles, very good. And... Yeah, I think we'll just switch this over, since we probably won't get up over to here. Uh, give me more time, though. Give me more time. Oh. Might as well do that one, too. I'm just going to wait for that one, so. That'll be good. That'll be oh, okay with us. For the love of God, Kaiser's Legion, please stop this. Please. Oh, if you want to read about this, please go right ahead. Even though it's on from the front. Well, I love the political power, but we could probably use more war support, honestly. Are we even making any more divisions? No, we're not. Alright, so at this point, we really don't have that much army XP. Mm. We are somewhat prepared. Not that's not bad. Do that one. Do that one. Cool. We just need more army XP. My goodness. Mm. I guess I can make these guys bigger first. Sneaky dudes, not bad. And let's grab some farming department. So then these guys will go and train and get us some more army XP as well. Oh, hello. Oh, there we go. Energy of the suns. Very good. Let's keep going. Keep going. Nice. Uh, Will Faster, do you have any upgrades? Cunning Desert Fox actually would be pretty darn nice. Yeah, because we'll be, we're will be we just all part of the desert here, so. Do I have, do I have anything for motorized equipment? Demos, ghouls, infantry, equipment capture ratio, leader skill bonuses, nerd rage, robotics, fire teams. Um, experience soldiers losses is not terrible to do. Not too bad. Awareness, recon would not be bad too. How much recon do they have? None, so that wouldn't help at all. Well, I guess get some more entrenchment, because we could always use more entrenchment, right? We're definitely going to need a lot more of this. Yeah, motorized vehicles. That's not good. So now we can't core stuff. God dang it. There we go. Go all the way up there. And eventually we'll get some chariots as well. We could get some more stability, but I'm going to wait. Eh, no, let's do it one. Do it one time. Let's be fine. Special forces expansion. So one, two. Thank you. And how are we building? Building up actually some military factories. That's not bad. Port Mall. Let's do that one next. Energy of the Suns, and the new industry. Trade between our two nations is flourishing. Already our drivers are using window glasses produced in Henta, while their engineers or engines power the ships of Entes. Growing merchant fleet, none can argue that this close co closer cooperation has been very beneficial for both sides. This is just so disappointing. I just can't wait for the NCR to attack so we can actually do something here. Oh, we can't do that one yet? Okay. Weapons to surpass Metal Gears. Most people would only ever get to see the cheap mass manufactured wares Enta del Sol has to offer. However, the Generalissimo, due to his close friendship with the people of Tucson, has granted us a unique opportunity to buy weapons directly from his personal stash, and we have no doubt they are worth every cap or legion denarii we spend on them. We got 400 things of Gauss rifles. That's really nice, actually. Um, eh, nah. Francisco, thank you. And let's start making some of this stuff. Cool. Thank you. Just one, though. Cool. Just in case. Oh, the Eastern Legion. Yep, I need to play as the Eastern Legion again. I remember the, the olden days where it used to be called Lanius' Legion, but Lanius has now gotten a downgrade. <sighs> sadness. Quite a bit of sadness, but whatever. Cool, we'll probably need to kill these guys off. I'm not sure where to send our soldiers then. Andreas? Sal Savage Leader, yeah. Uh, inspirational, so everyone gets that. Oh, look, a massive into the future. Look at that. Nice. More factory upload for half a year. Pretty good. Our own designs. Yeah, we'll probably go with more civvies first because we're still trying to build ourselves up. More civvies, infrastructure, tombstone. So, that'll be nice. And actually, we can do first, but first through Tucson. Increase the positive effect of our tracks. Oh, and there goes the Brotherhood. Dreams fulfilled. Wow, plus 30% factory output. That's really nice. But new industry first. Infantry are... Oh my goodness, that's so bad. Now they did mess... The devs did mess with the... At the time of this recording, the meta for divisions. So we could go with infantry or we go soft attack. Soft attack is almost 11. These guys, soft attack is 4, which is not that great. I don't want to lose organization though, because organization is super, super important. So eh, these guys do get more defense, and that's what you want to mostly use them for. They do have one entrenchment. But it does go up slightly. Eh, let's... This that takes less weight. You get more HP, more organization, same recovery rate. It, soft attack is just so low. It's just so ungodly low. Yeah, but we're doing okay. So we still have minus... Oh, actually, not too bad. We had minus 330 some over there earlier, so... Radio interception group. Eh, let's do that one. How much money do we have? Or how much money do we not have? 
Uh, 300 cell, that's not too bad. That's pretty good, actually. And a simulation, we can close out of that. New industry and our own design. We'll probably just get this one done so we get some more consumer goods and some more uh, stuff. Tres Helios. Our own design. A Generalissimo promised us guns and he delivered. However, now it is time we start developing some designs of our own. Intermediate infantry tech will be very good. Mass conscription, huh? Nope. Meeting their needs, not bad. Airbase raids. Uh, do some of that. I'm not sure we'll, really, we'll even really be doing some of that stuff, so. Uh, there you go. Get some more manpower. Coordinate onside, and we'll be done with the land auction. And then we can do guerrilla tactics anyways. We don't need to spend political power on that or army XP for that, because we don't have enough army XP. New industry, our own design. Followed up with... Thres Helios, or Helios. That's only 8-day focus, that's kind of unique. We know, we now see the wisdom of Kaiser when he chose to permit the people of Henta to become part of the Legion. Under his watchful gaze, we have come to give you the people to the south, not as prolificates, but as friends, and from now on it shall be th three sons that shine a bright light upon his ever-growing empire. <sighs> Until we leave, of course, but maybe that'll happen sometime. This is so sad. Actually, you know what? What are we doing? We could send planes over here to help out, just bomb the living crap out of them. That's fine. Do that. Because this will give us a lot more uh, things to use. A lot more air XP, hopefully. Well. There we go. 0 0.04 every single day? Well, when they're battling it out, I guess. Nice. Are we doing any damage? Any good damage? Eh, about 0 0.03. That's not too bad. We could use more planes. We could use more military factories. Just period. So. No stop up there. That's fine. We have a little bit more army XP now. Let's do some more infantry stuff, because these guys are just not that great. That's really sad. Holy crud. There you go. Keep training yourselves. And... There's Helios. Follow up with... But first, through to some. Our priests have determined that the roads built through the former territories of cowboy country are insufficient for needs. Currently, the region holds little value and even less people, but our development efforts shall lead to the founding new towns. Along the track, serving as pit stops, traveling from one corner of our land to the, to the other. Nice. And Grand Inquisition... We just need more infrastructure everywhere, so... Interrogation techniques. Let's go next. Cool. Follow it up with what? Expand the motorworks. That's uh, engines of wars. But well, let's do the technology first. Acclimatization training. Let's keep going down. Kaiser made his intentions clear, and as his subject, it'll only be a matter of time before we call it upon to support his war effort. We best start making our preparations now. Very true. So we're looking good, good. Looking very good here. Uh, we need more stuff here, so actually you guys can go probably right there-ish. And how are, how's the ship going? Tech, thank you. Do we have, a, do we have no Admiral? F Felix Diaz. Cool. All right, thank you, Felix. Thank you, thank you, thank you, th thank you. All right, anything else here? Um, anything for, like, motorized, perhaps? Energy weapons, power armor, combat. I'm not seeing a lot here for... I mean, that would be... This one would be good for us for infrastructure. But... Hmm... So it's all okay. We'll probably just go with this one. Screw it. Get more infrastructure. Make it even faster. Engines of War. Followed up with expand the motorworks. The cities of Tucson itself needs to be expanded along our growing industry, while hopefully giving us the ability to accommodate new garages, even when it comes out at the cost of potential living space. And Ernesto Zaragoza. Zaragoza? Zaragoza? Something like that? Cool. You know what? Screw it. You know what? Get some intel stuff on these guys. Just because we can. That might help them out with their with lowering their entrenchment and stuff, but whatever. <sighs> AI never change. Even though I've made the same mistake that they're doing right now before, too. I should probably be doing... Oh, war propaganda? Why not? That's pretty good stuff. We have no men to spare. Finally, for the party, that's fine. 56% chance of winning, huh? They're doing, being successful there. So, Kaiser's Legion has lost... Oh, there's not a doubt. 39,000 versus... Seven, Jesus Christ, 40,000. Why? Stop attacking! When the NCR attacks, you're not going to be ready. Even though they're not looking too good, either. But Jesus Christ, what the heck, guys? With five more army XP, nice. Nice, nice. At least these guys will be good in defense. Hopefully. <sighs> Hopefully. Follow it up with faster. Cars, yes. And immediate construction tech, that'll be good. Faster. Uh, get more car technology, which we will probably use to the best of our ability. We'll see what happens. We still have 35 air XP. And how are our planes? We're actually losing quite a few planes. This sucks. Oh, that doesn't help that. There's too many people here. Uh, can you go there, maybe? You guys go there? No? Hmm. 80s. Clear one vault city. Yeah, we're slowly losing all of our planes. God dang it. This kind of sucks. Well, we need more air bases. There you go. Record anything here yet? No. No. 
God dang it. Good other tactics are nice. Uh, we'll probably go with ballistics for this campaign as well, just because we can. So why can we record this? Puerto Pen Penasco. We need a thousand, well, basically eleven hundred motor vehicles, which we're getting there. We're definitely getting there. I, you know, I want to get in there and attack, but there's literally nothing for us to do there. I don't think we can justify anybody else either. So, yeah, we're a puppet, so we can't do that. Expand the motorcade, and then faster, faster, faster. Follow it up with. Complete industrial mobilization. Our government must now choose how to allocate our country's resources very carefully in order to achieve military victory while also meeting vital domestic demands. Nice. Also do foundries as well. We have a little bit more PP. We have 81% of that stuff. That's not too bad, but still. Silent partner. Ah. Uh, I might just go with um, encryption, dude. That's help that helps with uh, combat. It really does, actually. So... This is okay. Factory bomb vulnerability is not great. It's okay. Racing industrialist. That's not bad either. It's not great. Yeah, this will be good to do. Yeah, I'll do it anyways. Why not? I'm not even making any divisions. Not really, no. Um, fire teams, infantry armor, infantry equipment. It's not too bad. We need some anti-tank, but let's just maximize these guys first. Fire teams actually might not be too bad either. You lose your organization, which I do not like. But you get a little more soft attack, you get a little bit more HP, you lose 6 organization though, which I don't like at all. Faster, faster, faster. Complete industrial mobilization. I want high organization. Because they're just there for defense. My goodness. Please stop attacking guys. Please, 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 please. We already made them civvies, not bad. Well, we're running out of places to build stuff, so... I, I said, might say, I caramba. Hmm, 700 is not bad. Oh, whoa, Eastport, 80s was annexed. Oh, and the NCR doesn't just keep them in their faction. Yeah, they just, oh, the Nevada pack. Is this historic? This must be a historical or something, then. Oh, oh there goes a mo there goes a brother. There you go. Now, hopefully that'll end the war. You did okay on air XP, but other than that, man, not great. And how is the race doing? Hey, we are ready. Our technicians are ready. Sun Racers, well, do that one. Buy new parts, probably not. Test new prototypes. Is that worth it? I don't know. We'll see what happens. Apply what we've learned. Well, we'll wait then. Oh, there goes Sinaloa the Cartel. Resource efficiency, gain, arms and supplies. Yes, we'll probably do that one next. For more anti tank and logistics. Why not? Finally, we can do some intermediate construction tech. Finally. This is probably not going to go very well. I'm just waiting for the NCR to kill, come kill us or something like that, so. Oh, yeah, there they go. Nice. Nice. Completely surround them. Make sure no one can get in. No one can get out. Thank God for New Vegas. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I just said that. Uh, do we need him? No, we're very good on resources as well. Wow. We're completely stocked full. Oh, crap. No, oh, no, 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 no. Please don't give this to me. Um, I don't really want to give any of this stuff to anybody, so... Oh, don't tell me this is such high scores, too. Uh, let's see if we can just give this up to these guys. Please make sure it doesn't cost too much. I mean, they did most of the work, so... I don't think it's really fa really that fair to give anything here to uh, Camp McCarran. Uh, probably give it to the Legion. Oh, wait, what's the score? 400. Jesus Christ. I apologize for the clicking, everyone. Um, Hoover Dam is probably a whole tennis score, too. So. Oh, my goodness. Absolutely nuts. I mean, we didn't do that much. We just sent planes as such. So, My apologies about this. If you want to skip ahead in about like a minute, maybe it should be done by then. If not, thanks for staying. Alright. Oh. How much score is that? You can't even see how much score that is. Oh my goodness. Got a little player of the peace conferences. This is why I don't want to get involved in the war. Overdam is probably the most important piece of the thing here. So let's take a look. Oh, it's only 70. That's not bad. That's it. Cool. Yeah, at least the war's over. At least that's good for now. We lost like 30 planes, which sucks, but you know what, with them being at peace then, then maybe um, the New Vegas house will go to war with the Legion to take back territories, maybe? Oh, 69? Nice. Oh, well, that's not us. But, so, there you go. Well, I mean, we're ready to probably start coring stuff, but it costs so much. Hey, here we go. 617, not bad. I'll try it. We get another military factory, maybe? Potentially. 15, 15, 0. Not bad, not bad. 
items and supplies, let's go ahead and do optimize our designs. By improving on our existing designs, applying what we've managed to learn over the months we've been driving them will allow us to create faster and better versions of the currently existing ones, while limiting any potential weaknesses. Very cool. And after this, we're going to start really researching a lot of the vehicle stuff at this point. Uh, up next, we'll probably do faster and stronger. Our priests must strike a delicate balance between the, our protective armor, the strength of our engines, and the viability of our designs as a fast combat vehicle, all while trying to minimize the production costs for industry. APCs? Yeah, we definitely want to start producing some APCs. We just need more factories, but we don't have more factories. We need just a lot of stuff. And we want to get some saws, too, for infantry, because these guys are just straight-up defensive guys. Yeah, defense. 80? These guys have a defense of 62. Yeah, maybe infantry is not worth it. Yeah, I mean, infantry is not really worth as much as it used to be. 265 and 60, basically. 200. These guys even have more armor or organization. Chariots. Yeah, we'll still use some chariots, hopefully. Let's see what happens, though. Um, silent partner? Yeah, this one. No. This one, no. This one. No, this one. Yeah, encryption guy. Over here, yeah, might as well. I mean, there's no point to not do it, I guess, at this point. Road warrior, of course. Investments. Eh. Well, I kind of just wait. I'm going to do every cap for the army eventually. Oh, war equipment, nice. Stronger and faster, good. Alright, vehicle tech. Tech time. It's the average car. No blueprints for that, huh? Alright, whatever. And then we'll do... Tank technology, that'd be nice. Recon, Ultimo. I could probably do window to the sea, actually. It's only eight days. Now that we've established our control over Ultimo, it's time to lay down it for ships. But before that, we have to determine our goals in the Gulf. Should we aim for naval supremacy or just focus on naval invasions? Good point, good questions. Uh, research speed, medical technology is not bad. Water, actually, getting in that extra slot would not be too bad either. The racers, buy new parts. That's, that's for the technicians, right? Apply we have what we've learned. Testing new prototypes. That's kind of for racers, right? We'll see. I'm not sure which one's which, so. There you go. Night meetings, conscription drives, new tracks. 570 is not bad either. Let's get Murtaugh reformers. I really wish we could go to war. But with the Legion done, they still have quite a few thousand manpower, even though we're not making any more divisions. We're doing okay with that. That's a, diff that's a unique name. Wow. And let's go ahead and do assimilation. Yes. Basic small trees. Yes. There you go. And I'll get to the other one uh, later on. Um, armor of reconnaissance. No description. I'll write them. And then I do, do want to do this one. Let's see. Seven infrastructure. Seven infrastructure. Lower tariffs. Eh, no. I don't really care. Oh, treasure trove. Look at that. If you want to read about this, please go ahead. We get more manpower back. 100 units, 180 units of infantry equipment. Skills and training pays off. Great. So, we'll go ahead and do Miracle of Combustion Modern Armor. Miracle of Combustion. Oh, here we go. Success is a result of spontaneous combustion. You must set yourself on fire. Oh, no. Oh, oh, no. oh interesting. Oh, oh, the Legion did give him a lot of territory here, didn't they? Oh, wow, that's a lot. Let's see what we can do about that. You never know. You just never know what people are up to. There you go. Good luck. God dang, we need more military factories. Can we build any more? Yes, we can. That's very good. Boom, boom. And keep doing the stuff. Armor reconnaissance. Miracle of combustion would be nice. Yeah. More energy. We already have 47, which is not too bad, but still. Could be better. Could be a little bit better. Uh, how far are they along with this stuff? Watch me kill a god. Well, there you go. Yeah, maybe that's not good. Formation flying is good to get, though. Let's grab some preemptive interception. We're going to go and grab some of Miracle of Combustion. And we'll go do Modern Armor. With no description as well. Oh, boy. Well, then. Not bad. Not bad. But I wish it was just a little more interactive. I don't know. Just things to do. I mean, yeah, we did go to war with the Legion, well, with the Legion to get over here, but kind of stuck with where, where we're at. Do that one too. More defense is nice. Um, how much do we have in terms of spare equipment? That's not too bad. We have 30. Oh, we have 37. Speed. Scavenger drunk. Great. A mighty step into the future. Nice. Poseidon energy schematics. Actually, that could be pretty darn useful for us. Somewhat ready. Buy new parts. Um, apply what we've learned. Eh. I don't know about that one. Anything else here? Occupied territories. The Grand Inquisition is gone. They're looking pretty strong up north. Yeah, that's pretty nice brotherhood. Maybe we could do every cap for the army, but we need more for that. Investments fall through. Cut our losses. Just cut them. And modern armor. 
Five more days for the next tech, and hopefully these guys go to war soon. I, I want to get involved. Come on, let me get involved. I want to go to war. Please let us kill somebody. But up next, we'll go and do Mariner's Doctrine. Uh, what was this one? Did you guys choose to forget faster? Big guns? Naval attack? Heavy naval holes? Uh, basic aqua fires? All right, let's come over here and do some construction stuff first. I did say we would do some more car stuff or whatever. Well, we're going to go with the Mariner's Doctrine just because we have faster transports. And for this campaign, we want to go fast. Rudel has a plan and a great one. Why waste efforts and resources on big boats when we can just land our Marines in Baja, of course. We will have to train special Marine divisions, but flush is cheap. We get Castro, Rudel Castro, even though this one says Merito Mortimer. So whenever we play Two Sons again, please remind me that we need to take the big gun doctrine, because right now we're doing Marmers. Mariners. Marmers. Mariners. And we're not getting more naval XP because we're not rebuilding these things. That would be quite helpful if we did that. Salvage cars, good. I don't know if this is actually working, because we did the stuff to get, uh, I guess, blueprints ahead of time. I guess it's all ahead of time stuff, but, eh, whatever. Alright, so can we come down here and core this? No, we cannot. Can we come over here and core this? No, we cannot. God dang, you need so much motorized. But, there we go. Followed up with what? Faster transport, naval doctrine. Do get two more power stations, but let's do spirit tank development. We have made great improvements with our combustion engine. Its method of transforming energy into motion could be fit into a machine of the size of a carriage. And since an important technological advancement cannot pass without causing a stir in the military, we get the weapon of a new era, the tank. Very cool. Oh, there goes the Sinaloa Cartel. Goodbye, Sinaloa Cartel. So we did all this stuff. Yeah, I like that the, this nation has a unique tree. I think that's really special. I think that's really awesome, actually. We're in a practice run? Yeah, that'll be good. Apply what we've learned. Ah, do it anyway. Screw it. We are ready. The technicians are ready. And the Del Sol's technicians are not ready, though. And the 80s racers are just like us, somewhat prepared. Just somewhat, though. Yeah, that'll be good to get. Our resources are doing very well as well. But I do like that the devs are fleshing things out here. That's very nice. Very, very nice. They do have a lot of divisions, so come on, guys. Please attack us. Please attack us. Find your parts. Well, that's for technicians, so we don't need to do that one. Thanks, so. Seth. Thank you. Hey, man, small trees. Let's go back up here and finally do this. Switch back around. Scavenge tools. My bad. I should have done one earlier, but whatever. Local leaders will probably start fleshing this stuff out as well. Naval... Oh. oh, okay. So we can do this one. Wow, I didn't realize. Plus 30% capital ship attack and 10% more damage. That's unique. I've not seen that one before. That's actually extremely strong for capital ship attack. That's extremely strong. This is my opinion. Wow. Uh, invasion preparation time and naval invasion capacity. <coughs> for landing in Baja, that's still pretty good as well. 15 PP. Oh, that's so nice. We love the PP. Well-oiled machine. The rough deserts of Arizona have never been kind to of vehicles and complex machinery, however. One of the cult's youngest and most promising acolytes has discovered new holy oil that should help improve the reliability and reduce the tear that Arizona winds have on our tanks, earning himself the gratitude of all of Tucson and himself, the priesthood, for this discovery. Very nice. Very good. And metalworking is done as well. Cool. I'm going to grab that machine assisted decryption. Very good. we got some more stuff here too. Preemptive strike. Let's go back and do some more car stuff and waste on cars. Nice. I did say we probably want to get some um, maintenance companies on here too, but we'll see. Tank equipment will be doing very well. Let's go ahead and grab... Uh, we could grab that, but we'll do uh, this one over here. New Merchant Roads. In the southern parts of our Sp land, Spanish is still the primary spoken language, making it the ideal location to develop trade with the countries of former Mexico. By expanding our roads into the section, we will not only be able to open up new trade routes, but also finish a new section of our racetrack. And we get more positive effects of our tracks, which is nice. Come on. Who's... One of these guys going to kill each other? We want to kill each other. Please. We could build dockyards, but I don't really care. We could probably get some ra uh, radar stations, too, eventually. But then again, we don't have the tech for it, which really sucks. Really, really sucks. So, um, Mr. Encryption, might as well. Actually, we could do uh, Poseidon. Because that's, that's really good for power station construction speed. Electronics, technology. Eh. Whatever. Cap count. I yeah, almost done with oil machine. Test new prototypes. And that's good to do it. I don't think that's really going to help us out at all. And that one too. Yeah, with 600 stone, that's not bad. There you go. Par Panzers of our own. Cool. Sky Reavers, NCR. Oh, we haven't done NCR yet. Okay. And we're going to do Kaizo's Hammer. Under the orders of the High Priest of Nas himself, all of Tucson has come together. Mechanics, racers, and for the first time, even people from the outside, although we have since insisted that they shall remain in our territory as our honored guests. All leading to the creation of a new design that shall form the basis for the ultimate weapon, and a weapon capable of rivaling even those used before and in the Great War, if not surpass them. 
We can take the technology stuff. Nice. Infantry as we're 20 combat width. So we probably need some actual yeah, getting this get even more HP, which is nice. More defense. No soft attack, but that's okay. Let's go and do that one, because we we definitely need some piercing power. Plating add-ons. Nice, nice, nice. Scrap, scrap gun trucks. Very good. That should help us out a little bit here. And then two uh, Sunriders. Let's make sure that we're like at least 20 combat with at the very least. Eh, that's not a bad amount of armor, actually. The organization's not too bad. We could use some recom. But any support companies we throw on are just not going to be helpful to us. Because it lowers our armor. Well, maintenance companies, maybe. Let's go ahead and do Kaiser's Hammer. Followed up with with what? Aura et Labora. Two sun treatments of its involuntary servants is vastly different to that of the Legion. Our slaves are granted far more autonomy with the promise that they shall be set free as repayment for years of service. However, we may treat them like friends, only separated from us through lower station. But that it does not change the fact that they are still slaves, and as such, the daunting task of acquiring the resources that fuel our industry will fall upon them. And prospecting slaves. We love it. We love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. And, yeah, we can build some more cities up here in Yuma, but that's not a trade node, right? North Phoenix, two suns, nope. Nope. Military them. Because we still need more of this stuff. Can we actually convert or core anything here? How much should we have? Um... Oh, we have 900. We have a lot of chariots. So many chariots. You guys go and train some more. Because we definitely need some more. I like that we do get stuff from well faster. Gets us, lets us do more stuff more quickly. Old world tactics are nice. Kaiser's hammer. Aura at Labora is very good as well. So yeah, two sons. It's not the most... I'll put it like this. I'll be honest with you guys. Like I like being honest. Um, it's not the most interesting nation. There's a lot of flavor added to it, which I do like a lot. I like that there's a lot of flavor added to this, but... Oh my god. Eastern Legion. Why? Why? Why do you suck so much? You have enough manpower. Where's your equipment? They have only 13,000. What the heck? How did... How, why are you losing Lanius? How hard did they nerf Lanius in the east? Oh my goodness. Because most of my campaigns now, even the Hangdogs are gone. I guess they were defeated by Lanius, but with the Iron Alliance only helping them out. What the heck is wrong with these people? What the heck is wrong with Lanius? I gotta play them again. I gotta see how weak they are or something. Because this is just, this is extreme, man. This is not cool. Hmm, we can wait for that one. Where are we for autonomy? Wow, this is so bad. Um, and then we'll do faster transports. For the last couple months, we've made a noticeable progress in our landing transport design. Now they'll no longer fall apart before we're reaching the coasts. Okay, are we close at all going to war with the NCR? I want to kill off our enemies so badly. A second legate? Where are we, what are we doing? Where, where is this stuff? They're taking so long to get down to the burn man. New generation to the west. Oh my goodness. Where is the NCR in their uh, focus tree? Because it's already 2281. Refurbishing a po the power plant. Um, Can't spare much right now. Don't really care. Oh my goodness. There you go. Nice. Better cars. Better cars are very good. 600 some. God dang it. Bricks. Not bad. Let's grab some more resource extraction, which we don't really need right now. Uh, let's see what else we got. We got a little bit more here. Sunriders. That's 20 combo with. We want 10, so we can at least get those maintenance companies on. We'll lose some organization, which I don't like, but we do get some more HP. Get more reliability. Not too bad. And get more equipment capture ratio. Not bad. And we're super close. There you go. So we'll save us hopefully on some other stuff as well. So faster transports followed up with. Full steam ahead. Every fleet needs fuel to power up our newborn navy. Oh, my bad. Uh, several power plants need to be built across the coastline. Can't afford this, pretty much. Don't really care what the, those people think. How are we doing? We're doing well in here. We got that. We need to get some saws as well, still, and do some of this. Because we have at least one factor in everything. Not bad. We need their needs. Uh, we lose our construction speed at plus two. Eh, let's go and do it. Why not? We don't really need to build new tracks. Great race preparations. Just do a practice one, I guess. Because the racers still are not done yet. I don't want to buy new parts because I won't do anything for racers. Oh, my goodness. Full steam ahead after that. Is that it for the focus tree? Oh, we can still, still do new merchant roads, which we'll do that one too. And all roads lead to Phoenix. Gila and Yuma. Wait, why do we not have these done yet? And we're building up a lot of air bases, which is nice, but we don't really need them right now. There you go.
We go full steam ahead. And the merchant roads next. Beautiful. So basically, as you can tell, this is probably the last episode of this campaign, just because I... God dang it, the Eastern Legion. Um, I want to uh, just go to war with the NCR and probably call it a campaign. There's not really much else here to do, so... It is what it is. Cool. Plastic explosives. We're getting through this stuff pretty quickly. I like that we have a level 10 uh, trade note already, so... Anything else? Scavenger vehicles, you might as well. 700 monies. Give us more refugees, please. We want more population. It's great. Guys, please kill each other off, please. Fortifying the capital. Infiltrate the NCR. Well, that's good. Can you guys kill somebody too? Please. Please, please, please. Military investments. I. Okay, they went to war with those guys. I don't want her to defense, but I like the attack. I don't want her our cap's expenses, though. Because right now, cap's expenses are actually not too bad. That's actually pretty good. What if we were to take this one? We get more attack and defense for infantry and motorized. But we don't need to do that one yet because we don't need to hurt our budget yet for stuff like that. So we're done with our stuff for now. I do want to do the great race, but we need to do this one. But it takes forever to get that stuff done. So in the meantime, we don't need more PP. Let's do this one first. And then we'll increase our autonomy as well. We just need to build Gila up as fast as possible. There you go. This one first. Distribute pit boys. Nice. Night meetings. Uh, that's fine to do. Whatever. We have a PP for it, so that'd be fine. And we're ready. We're finally ready for all this stuff so we can launch the great race whenever we really need to. So, can we do this one? Yep, yes we can. All roads lead to Phoenix. We cannot expect all countries to possess the level of internal integration two sons has to offer. By expanding our roads into Yuma, we can take partake in the lucrative trade along the Colorado while also completing another step in a race construction project. Nice. And then we can do dreams fulfilled after that. But, of course, we have tracking dogs first. Quadrant searching tracking dogs? Tracking dogs are nice. What about tracking cars? Dreams fulfilled. The task of building roads this close to the coast proved, proved long and difficult. However, we are we sure paid it off. Our land is now perfectly connected by land, river, and sea. We have a little time to appreciate the beautiful scenery, however. With the last piece of road paved, our nation is finally ready to hold the great race we've always envisioned. Way more factory output. And that's awesome. Actually, yes, we got one first. So we start doing some tank stuff to steal some tech. Anti-partisan stuff. That'd be nice. I guess at this point... Oh, contact loss. Well, that's not good. Um, we can, at least we can try. That'd be good. Local agent recruitment. Don't care. Let's do that one too. Forgers. That's fine. And send a rescue team, which always succeeds. Which is good, great and all, but it seems like we should have the possibility of not being able to succeed, succeed sometimes, but whatever. Whatever. It is what it is. All roads lead to Phoenix. Dreams fulfilled. And we will launch the race very soon. Well, bad word. Are you kidding me? Immediately. Wow. Oh, for the love of God, please don't attack. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? Just hold the... the we're going to be the defensive line here. I'm going to keep our infantry kind of south for now. Just because uh, you never know if they might launch raids. And we don't really have a navy to do any of this stuff, so... We'll be here just to hold. At least over here, for now. Let's get over there first. You guys, stop training and do this. Do some, uh... There you go. Something like that. Three divisions. Uh, six, six divisions. Victory points and ports. That's fine with us. Anything here? Inspirational, rooted, go... Uh, let's go Mysterious Stranger, because we don't have to be entrenched to get the bonuses for that, so... Old World Tactics. Well, that sucks that's lost immediately. Um, oh my god, please don't attack how crazy. Please, guys, please. NCR Rangers and the She? Sure, why not? Alright, we're helping out Big Daddy here. Stop trading because we don't want to lose our ships. Our ship. Uh, yeah, attack us. Oh, we actually, actually broke over. Look at that. It actually broke over. That's not too bad. Anti-partisan stuff? Not bad. Get even more anti-partisan stuff. Become a spy master if we can. Yes, please. We're not spy master because they didn't want to be it. Alright, not bad. And now they're attacking us, which is good for us to defend here. So, Yes, finally we're at war, my friends. We're finally at war. We can finally do something. I want some chariots too, so. Um, chariot platoons. These are four combat with each, which is insane. Two. That's a 16, huh? It's not enough for us. And how much motorized do we have in reserve? 600 something? That's not enough. Keep defending. Please don't fail here, guys. Please don't fail. I mean, we can always fall back, but launch the race. Salvage gun trucks. Nice. There you go with that. 
APC divisions too. Not bad. Let's start making maybe one of these at a time. We don't want too many because we only have so much money that we can spend, so. Not bad. And how are we doing with this? Will faster? Hopefully becoming a Hills fighter. Very good, very good. Declare one of the Cyphers. Hopefully they don't go to war with the Legion anytime soon. So we have our guys prepared. Got scrap gun trucks. We need a hundred of you guys. We have no military factories. That kind of sucks. Not going to lie. So let's come back down here and do the Fathers of the Apocalypse because it'll give us a new building slot, which is why I kind of chose them earlier because I knew we would run out of space here. Go figure. Greater Mexico section. Nah, don't interest, I'm not interested in that. Watch out for spies. That'll be good. Oh, they actually broke through. Look at that. Nice. That's pretty good of you guys. Oh, don't get encircled, though, guys. Please, please, please do not get encircled. Oh, wait, do you guys have... Ooh. There you go. If you guys are going to defend there, that's fine with us. The three, three, three. Oh, are we losing here, too? You know what? You might just send them back here as well. Actually, do this. Send them right here, but really send you guys over here. Just in case. Help divide it up for now. Because I don't want to lose this spot. And we don't. I don't mind baiting them into attacking us. So, that wouldn't be too bad. And Andreas Alvarez? Oh, from Antares, Justinian. Yeah, I'm going to go with Justinian just because. As much as I love this guy, we got to go with him. Launch the race. Finish line. Sophisticated vehicle tech. Awesome. I love that icon. That's really cool. And I guess for now, um, there's not really much we can do. I guess increase autonomy? So, is there anything about the race here? Um, we can use more stability. I don't see anything. Great race preparation. No. Is, is is there anything we can do? Oh, how about this stuff? Oh, motorized speed. Less division attrition would, wouldn't be bad, actually. Local recruitment dress. No, there's nothing. There's nothing about the race. Is there nothing? Uh, huh? I mean, I don't. I'm not expecting like a custom GUI or anything like that. But I mean, that would be that would make a lot of sense if we could actually have that. That'd be really cool if we could have that. Uh, at this point, you guys just do this too. Not bad. Um, three, two, one, go! The racers have taken off uh, from the Temple of Mars mere moments ago, beginning their epic journey across Sonora. Currently, our contestants are hindered from showing the full power of their vehicles by the rough terrain. However, with each of the racers determined to be the first to pull ahead to reach the open roads of the West First, there is no doubt that the competition has already started. Our first reports have finally reached us, and it seems that the Juggernaut leads the early laps, while Sun Eater is able to stay close behind him and keep the pressure on, all the while putting enough of a gap, never more than five seconds, but always bigger than the one in front to a yellow bet behind him. Meanwhile, Y is recovering from a spin, but still manages to overtake Thunderbird. We will, of course, be right back with you as the race enters the second stage. May the best win. Nice. Well, at least we got something there. I do like that little bit of flavor. How are we doing up here? They're still attacking. What are the losses like? We've lost. 83, 4,000 versus 5,000. I hope the Legion's just not trying to kill off its own manpower, please. The NCR is not that smart either, but still. The Road West. Here we are yet again with another status report. The racers have passed the mountains of Arizona and entered the fertile and wide open plains of Sonora at full speed. And our observers are sadly only able to determine their current location due to the roaring of their engines and the tremendous dust clouds our racers leave behind. Nonetheless, we have been able to conclude that Yalubat pressured Sunny to lock up and then set up a brilliant round around the outside past turn four to move into third place, but he was unwilling then push for second place straight away, saving his tires. That position became his Anyways, a Thunderbird car slowed down to a near to a halt at the halfway point around the tip of Sonora, forcing him to hold and do repairs, allowing Wyatt to ride past him. During all this, Juggernaut has managed to expand an earlier lead he had since the races have left Oro Valley. Just wait till he till he reaches the open plains. I don't trust the Legion's AI at all. I really don't. <laughs> ah, they actually took out the Mojave Apples. That's pretty cool. If they're attacking. We're going to do that one then. Up, up, uproot their entrenchment. And I'll screw it to it. Come down here to them. Uh, we can't really do anything around there. That sucks. The Yuma Turn. We've once again been brought news of our competitors. This time from the beautiful Sunshine Coast as the racers try to outdo each other, taking the treacherous turns that closely follow the Henta coastline. Even the slightest misstep could spell the early end of their ambitions. Nonetheless, they rarely or rarely ever slow down, displaying their drift prowess at every turn. Juggernaut enters the first obstacle flawlessly. Thunderbird, however, made the one mistake of the day. He entered a little bit tighter than he should have and took wide along with him. That cost him dearly. This cost him dearly, throwing both temporarily off the road, costing them precious seconds, allowing a Yalabut and Sun Eater to pass them by 
die. And close in on Juggernaut. Drifting is our speciality. Nice. Well, at least we're holding. That's the most important thing. And how many motorized do we have yet? APCs are looking bad. Motorized still 800. That's not too bad, actually. And we should have enough for chair platoons, maybe? 20 combo with at least. Please, thank you. Thank you. The Mountain Pass. We have once again spotted our... Oh, that's not good. Uh, our neck-on-neck -neck riding competitors after we lost sight of them leaving Enta City. They have since entered the treacherous mountain passes of East Sonora, and while the tight track itself offers few opportunities for one racer to pull ahead, these are the best, so we shouldn't be surprised about any rapid changes that may take place in this in most in inhospitable section of the race. Our mountain trackers have identified Yellowbat in the lead, with Joga not following close behind, while Wyatt, Sun Eater, and Thunderbird were briefly slowed down as each of them tried to ram the other two down the cliff. We are not slowing down. And actually, can we go here and do this? Yes, every cap for the army. I like to do this one, but that hurts our caps even more, and I prefer this one, so. So I have a GPC, nice. Less, more supply use, so that's not good. But it is what it is. Simple tracks, great. Improvised tanks. Oh, the finish line. Oh, quadrant searching too, nice. Air stuff? Well, just do bomb gliders too, because you can. Ladies and gentlemen, super mutants, boys, girls, and ghouls, as you can undoubtedly tell by the dust clouds being thrown up in the distance, our racers have finally arrived, and the fact that none of them have been eliminated along the way or fallen significantly behind can only be seen as a testament to the driving skills. This is still everyone's game. I'm happy to announce that Yellowbird has taken the lead by almost an arm's length with a juggernaut having finished or having taken the position right next to him. In the shadows of these two legends, I can spot Wyatt as well as Sun Eater, ready to take this race on its final meters, slightly behind them all, but quickly picking up speed is Thunderbird. Clearly, we are going to be able to pronounce the winner of the great f first first great race of Tucson. Any second now? Gas, gas, gas? <sighs> is this a gas, gas, gas? Are we talking about, like, a certain Mr. Hitler? Oh. Yeah, we're still defending. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh! You guys... Oh, this is not good. This is not good. Oh, this is really not good. Um, the, in their efforts to try to do extremely well here... They're going to be cutting our sources down very poorly, I guess you could say. Get in there and defend every little step along the way you can. Actually, if you guys could attack here, actually attack here. Help attack. Oh, never mind. They, those guys died. Whatever. The finish line. Beautiful. And we get sophisticated technology tech. Cool. I guess at this point, we're done with the focus tree. So, I guess from here on out, I suppose we could just like, uh, I suppose we could help attack, I suppose, right here. These guys don't look really that good, though, but encircling divisions is quite a good thing to do. Oh, and they're attacking us again. Um, yeah, I mean, as you can tell, this is from the paddle. This is the last episode. Where it's, hey, nice. If you want to do about that, please go ahead. So, not too bad. Oh, we actually overran a division over there, if you didn't see that. Right here. Look at that. Beautiful. Help them out. Not bad. We've lost 200 some. They've lost 11,000. That's about equal in terms of casualties, but obviously we're not being the dum-dums here. If you want to do about that, please go ahead. Let's grab some more stability this time, because we're kind of blocking. Some oversight. Alright, not bad. They're not naval invading us, so that's good too, so. And we ran out of things to build. Wow, that sucks. Hmm. <laughs> Plane wise, how are we doing? We have no extra spare planes, of course. Why would we? Oh crap. No, 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 no. Please. Oh good god. Oh. Why? Why would you do that? Actually, at this point, screw it. We're going to concentrate our forces right, right here or something. Concentrate our forces. We might be able to push in, maybe. Let them finish. Oh, come on. I mean, our guys are not too bad, actually, but still. We don't have a very superiority, too, so which kind of sucks, but whatever. All right, so you guys hold. we got to figure out what we want to do in a circlement. Because this is the only way the AI is going to win with us. Something like that. Actually, well, whatever. Go, go, go. Agent captured, not good, not good. Do we not have enough? No, oh, very odd. Okay, well, well, whatever. Just make sure we don't get in circle ourselves. Go, 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 go. Begin immediately assaulting their position and do not let them move. Oh, Kaiser's Legion, why did you do that? 
Good. Big one guy here. It ain't much, but it's honest killing. And we still have enough energy cells, so we're looking pretty good. Three divisions, not bad. Not too shabby. Ooh, do that too. There you go. Good, good, good. You know what? We might be able to break through here. Go, go, go. Flee, flee, flee. Take them all out. Take them all out. Where are their divisions? I see a lot of up here, but... Payload gliders are nice. Uh, let's grab some of this stuff, too. We're flinging through here, hopefully. Well, it helps if I give them uh, orders, so... Go, go, go. Get to Dana Point. Cut them off. Take out all the points. Improvised tanks are nice. Get some military cards as well. Sixteen thousand losses. They've up to, hundred. Whoa! They had one eighty-five, eighty-two something like right there. So, but now they went down, huh? Come on, guys, keep pushing, keep pushing. You're doing great. You're doing great. All right, that's fine. Adobe housing. Let's grab this one too. We might need to stop attacking. Let the legion come up here first too. Uh, yeah, stop attacking. Yeah, stop attacking. Yes, hold. Actually, if you guys want to go right there, that's fine. Just kill them all off that way. Nice, not bad, not bad. You guys are doing okay. You guys just hold the line. That was actually a pretty good uh, breakthrough here. God dang it, you might as well, I suppose. They're slowly pushing in, but the Vegas is not pushing in, though, huh? Alright, well, whatever. Just keep defending and doing what you're doing best, so. I don't want to risk these soldiers, but we might have to. We've lost 600. We've killed off 5,000, so. I'd say that's pretty good so far. Readers wins, not bad. If you want to help out there, you might be able to win. No? Okay. Uh, motorized? Oh, we do have enough. We can actually core something else too, that'd be good. Um, this has a lot of Ultimo, yeah. That's uh, so much industry and resources. To have that core is extremely good. There you go. Get some tanks in there too. Nice. Any planes, bomb gliders? Now we're pretty okay with that stuff. Yeah, it's going definitely okay. Not great, but not bad. <sighs> Legion, please stop attacking. Please. Hello, God, please. Oh, they actually lost over here, too. That's not good. They're starting to lose over here. These guys are going to... Oh, my gosh. Not good. Not good. I could risk it. Because these guys need some more defenses right here. Volatile fuels will be nice. Reliability, not bad. Over here, is there anything else we could do, maybe? Um, we we'll get more organization, I suppose. It's not gonna help us out that much, but everything else, every little piece helps, you know? Anything upgrades? No, that's fine. They're doing well in Baja, which is a little surprising. Oh, Henta, actually. Maybe oh, that's pretty good. Good job, guys. Where are you guys at? Are you moving or what? Let's get moving, boys. Nope, we don't have time for that right now. Now, these guys have gotta be taking more losses than this. Because they're just attacking, 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 attacking like crazy. Brotherhood, 173, 50,000 manpower, 100,000 manpower, basically 123 divisions. Yeah, without us, that's not good. Just keep defending for now. If you need to retreat, that's fine. Yeah, we should be getting a lot of experience. 29% Hills Fighter, 30% towards Urban Assault Specialist. But at least we were able to break through, which is nice. But this is, ooh. This is just, ooh. Nice. How are we doing over here? Yeah, might just want to do something like boom to boom. Be the ultimate defense right here, maybe. Hit two points here, maybe, just in case. Or we could do something like this. Send half of you guys here. You'll be fine there, probably. Hang out. Have a good time. You three, just hang out here, too. That'd be fine. And we should do okay. We should do relatively okay. Chariots, we definitely need them on the line. That'd be... Oh. There you go. Not bad. Pretty good. Pretty darn nice. Good job, guys. Yeah, not too bad. Oh, I don't like the AI. You know, the Legion AI, because we're slowly losing here, which is not very good, but 
We're doing the best we can. 32% for Hills Fighter, 15% for Urban Assault Specialist. But having this area done will be extremely helpful because then once these guys are dead too, that'll be super, 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 super good. Are they doing last stand? They gotta be doing last stand, right? No, they're not. That doesn't make any sense. Why they just survive there? But whatever. Um, and this has got to be costing them an extreme amount of equipment. Hey, look, they lost four, some more divisions, which is pretty nice too. So, and infantry should be doing okay. I forgot we still. Oh, we still need to rescue this guy too. But we need to get some um saws. Oh, we're doing pretty well here now. That's pretty good. And over here, we're doing okay. Hopefully, they can finish those guys off. Oh, please don't attack, guys. Please do not attack. Just let them attack you. Californian League, 155 divisions. Slow losing more manpower. But I think I will finish this off screen, and I'll see you in just a little bit. All right, everyone. So here we're at, and it's now September 8th, 2285. I've just been sitting here, just kind of hanging out and uh, doing stuff. So basically, Kaiser had his little civil war. Um, and let's see, who, who won? Who was it? Lucius. Lucius won, and we made sure he won as well. Uh, Volpus, we killed them off. Actually, we killed off Aurelius' Legion the first. And then these guys. And then, actually, New Vegas did push over. We're still trying to kill them off, but here are the cavalry so far. We've killed off 12... Or we've lost 12,000 soldiers. Not very good. We've done 39% of all the total war participation. We have killed off 173,000 enemies of the NCR. We've done extremely well against them, as you can see on screen. Um, we're not doing too badly, but we have some focuses. Because of the Civil War, we actually get a new, unique little part of the tree. Death of a God. The unthinkables happen. Kaiser has died and now self proclaimed successors are squabbling over the remains of his empire, and while none of them can ever truly replace him, we have to choose among them the most likely candidate to succeed for the good of two sons. So we can't choose a new Kaiser because we don't like Volpus and he's dead. But we can go with loyalty is its own reward. So which will be very good. Uh, also off screen, I've just been just collecting like PP and stuff like that. Um, really not much has really happened, honestly. I ran out of things to build. I had to mobilize it to another level as well because, well, this is taking forever and we lose some political power doing that, but whatever. But loyalty is its own reward. Volpus' bids for power has failed and we do not manage to support him in the time. However, we can still do right by our friend by offering him refugee and shielding him against his pursuers. The fox is allowed to say, and we shall listen. Here, oh, are we done here? Oh, what's going on? Wait. I, what's going on? Because I, I, I got autonomy for it. We, I was just doing my own stuff. And we actually got autonomy as well. Uh, can I join your faction? Wait, why are we not in the faction anymore? What? What? This made us leave the faction? We leave... Okay, two leave CS. What the heck? Are you kidding me? Can we at least get military access to these guys? Because we were doing... We're literally the only reason why these guys have been doing well. We're literally the only reason why these guys are still alive. Actually, we just lost a division. How do we lose a division here? What the heck? Because we were the ones fighting here the entire time. If it wasn't for us, the Legion would have died by now. Oh, that's so stupid. Why? Why? What the heck? Oh, Jesus Christ, what the heck? The winner of the Civil War undoubtedly will try to restore Kaiser's empire and all of its glory, and those ambitions include our lands. Volpus is from Atari already on their way, so we just have to choose which side to take. What do you mean? We already... We're being loyal. Please, just... We, we lost three divisions because of the, of the stupid focus. Are you kidding me? Wh why? Why? Why do we just leave? That makes literally no sense. Why would we just leave? And we lost four divisions because... Oh, my God. Well, I didn't have any issues off screen at all with these guys. We were able to manage and do all this stuff so far. This is incredibly stupid. Holy crap, why? For the love of God, why? I mean, we're, we can only do one way, so what the heck? Wow, that that is not so very well with me at all. That, Jesus Christ. From Atari can teach us a lot? Well, that's nice. Apply the upgrade merchant spies to intelligence agency. What, what, expand the surveillance? For the last few months, campaign of underground terror led by Volpus has achieved great results. We should contribute more to it. But we didn't go for Volpus. Yeah, this feels unfinished. It really feels a little bit unfinished here. Mm. So basically, with this, this is pissing me off. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and take all Baja. I don't care. I'm just going to take all of it. I don't care what Enta del Sol has, but I'm going to take it anyway. It's because we can. Are we, we still have not managed to break through here. And New Vegas, well, they have no energy cells, which is basically making us win. 
These guys have 73,000, and then you guys have 90,000 manpower left. If it wasn't for us, the NCR would, would have squashed the Legion. Or at least New Vegas would have, so... This is BS. This is absolute BS. Why would we just leave the Legion? We should get an option immediately as soon as Kaiser dies. Regarding whether he whether we stay loyal or we leave. A new Kaiser. The false Kaiser has rejected our offer. It's clear to us now that he is unworthy of our service in the first place. We will make him regret this decision and correct our previous error in judgment by joining the rightful Kaiser, which is, of course... This is... No, I'm sorry. This is just not... This is not right. This is just... New Kaiser? Uh, this is exactly the same thing. Men are worth... Yeah, I don't know. I don't like this at all. I really don't. This is one of the things I... I I will say I reject this. Like, this is just not cool. The way this is set up, not smart at all. Very not smart. Not smart at all. My goodness, like, what? You're destined to die then. That doesn't make any sense. Why? Why are we forced out of the thing? Like, if you do this one, it should not force you out. You should have the option of leaving or sticking. I mean, we literally stuck the entire time. I didn't even do the focus off screen. We were just sitting here, and I was just like, okay, well, that's nice to do the focus, but I want to do them when I'm back recording to show everyone what it's like. That is just... Why? Why? That makes no sense. That literally makes no sense. Oh, my goodness. Well, it is what it is, I guess. So we'll finish up this war as best as possible. Once NCR is dead, then we'll definitely be able to take up the leech, the rest of New Vegas. But can we please speed this up? I mean, our guy's got a lot of upgrades here, so. And I've been doing this for about an hour off screen already, so. Oh, man, this is taking a while to do, man. Taking quite a while. Oh, my goodness. This is such a pain in the butt to do. Crazy horns. Can someone else? Man, like I said, if it wasn't for us, the Legion would have already died. So doing this is just kind of dumb. But these guys are all in circle, so that's actually really good. Keep scooping them up. And we did. We were able to get tanks. Well, let's see. Do we, have, do we have 10 divisions here? Huh. Yeah, we were able to get tanks and some APC divisions, which is pretty nice, but still. Well, we're overrunning them over here, which is not too bad. We should hopefully distracting them. Expand the surveillance wise, well. But I, I already did everything here. What the heck? The Cabal? Um, okay then. Oh, I forgot to do this stuff. Oh, that's my fault there. I forgot to do about this stuff, but whatever. It doesn't really matter at this point, though, so... Yeah, that that focus needs to get looked at again. That's not very fair. That's just not fair at all. Just leave the faction. Just leave the faction. You, you have no say of what happens. Even if you wanted to rejoin, you still can't rejoin. What? Why? Man. Well, it looks like... Hey, we actually broke across. That's pretty good. Not bad. Keep forcing it through, though, because these guys are running out of energy. You guys force this through, too. I'm sick and tired of this at this point. This is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Um, we're doing okay here. Over here, we're still doing okay as well. We're kind of avoiding Shady Sands, though. We're really trying to kill off Citadel, Ranger Citadel. Look how, look how slowly they're moving. Early, we're moving so fast because we were leading the way. Bunch of allies doing super well. I thought we'd finish the war by now, but just because the game is like, nope. The focus is just not very good. Just not very good. Just, just leave the focus. Just leave the faction. Go, 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 go. Get rid of these guys. No more rangers. Something like that. Doesn't matter to me. Cut them in. Cut them in. Cut them off. Cut them off. No more desert rangers. Oh, it took shitty sands. Well, I'm, at this point, I don't know. We'll see what happens. I'm just not really sure what to say about this anymore. <laughs> Alright, so we've actually broken through, finally. I can give New Vegas to the Legion. I don't mind that. But I'll take a massive chunk of the NCR then, if it's going to be like this. Expand the surveillance, and that's it. Alright. I, mean, I got my freedom, but I didn't want to be fully liberated. I want to be part of the faction. So, we got screwed, man. We got really screwed here. Please just kill them off. I don't even care. Just kill them all off. Please, please, please. Oh my goodness. I mean, look at that. We were kicked out of the faction. We've done 42% of everything here. Uh, also, um, Navajo did rebel eventually, and well, we were all allied, so that's a little bit crazy, but whatever. 99% of the way there, we've killed off 185,000 just to get kicked out of the faction. That that does not leave a very good taste in my mouth at all. Like, holy crap. We've killed off 11,000 people from Two Sons. 
the Commonwealth is did us, did us in 5,000. So, I don't know. This is just... This is messed up. This is seriously messed up. Uh, oh, wait. It's your fell. Wait, who's... Oh, my God. The is still here, huh? I don't want to have to have, to have these guys out. Oh. oh, my God. We can't even go over there because the supply is so bad. Arrgh. Well, the she should fall pretty soon. I can't imagine that they're that strong, but... Yeah, 2,000. They're out of stuff. It's not terrible. Could be better. The Legion should be able to mop it up, but you never know. You never know with the AI, man. You just never know. Let's pick us, Fondy. Yeah, that's really sad. Say it's coil form, but they're dying due to Texas, so. Yeah. Hmm. Please just go. Please. Good. 69,000 lost. I can do so much better than them. Alright, so over here, we're not really winning anymore. Oh, gosh dang it. Come on, Legion. We're slowly winning here, too, which is not too bad, but still. Just go. Please just go to San Fran. I'd like to go to San Francisco someday, but we'll see what happens. 88% there towards becoming a mountaineer. We're getting there. Not yet, but we're getting there. It literally makes no sense why we're kicked out. Okay, and you can't even rejoin. Because we're not allowed to join factions, which is stupid. So these guys should die, maybe? It depends on if the AI has its navy in its water, because we have no navy, really. Which kind of sucks, but whatever. They still have no energy cells, so we should be doing relatively okay here. Yep, 60, not bad. Still going down, but they keep throwing more divisions in here, probably. They have so many divisions there. 104, that's just, actually, that's really good for us. They started with like 180 or something like that, so that's kind of extreme earlier. Keep going, keep going, keep putting a lot of pressure on them. If you let them live, let them move, they're going to have too many areas to go to. Actually, they're going to send Raphael, which is actually really bad, but whatever. Con Concord, they'll be dead after this. There you go, we got them. Yeah, no, this... This was really stupid, I'll be honest. This was incredibly stupid. I'm a little disappointed. That, that focus... Mmm, mmm. If you've never tried this before, at least, and if you're watching now still, thank you for your watching. Uh, at least you know what you can expect with stuff like that. This is what I want to take. This is going to become part of Tucson's territory. This part of Mexico. That's nice. We deserve a whole lot of this stuff. You know what? Screw it. I'm taking more of it too. Um, uh, there you go. That's a little nice. Let me take the uh, Yeah. Because honestly, without us, they would have died. Give these guys and stuff. Um, you can have the rest of these guys. There you go. You guys can have the she. I don't care about them. And the rangers. There you go. This is all going to be our territory. Would you want a crown? Cool. And technically, while they're not connected, it, we could make, probably, in my mind, make a big old land bridge here. So they can uh, connect stuff. Not too bad. Not too bad. And we're trying to finish this off, but I, I don't know. We might. We might not. How strong are you? Huh? That's okay. Waterproof ceiling. Doesn't really matter. Comp recoil compensation studies. Uh. Uh. Ah, uh, stuff has been demilitarized, that's fine, whatever. Uh, worst part, why not? Uh, anything else here, really? We can do that stuff, too. We can do some of that stuff. Our economy's doing okay. We have more than enough money for now. Um, yeah, send half you guys over here, too. That'd be fine. Voxel Doctrine is fine. We can grab some of this as well, because why not? We got more than enough air XP. Uh, hopefully, we'll just fight, 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 fight through here. It's just... I don't know, the dust stacking... I don't know. With all these robots, it makes sense to have a lot of robots, but... Having a cap on robots probably wouldn't be good either for this. That probably wouldn't make too much sense. Oh, we left the faction. That's why we don't have uh, three guys. That makes sense. So long for the front. Eh, let's get some more war support. Because we don't really need the PB anymore. Can't spare much right now, pretty much. Oh, this is so sad. Because they're out of equipment. They're literally out. They have nothing left. They're running out of manpower now, too. Look at all that equipment they don't have. Look at all that. They have some dynamite. And nothing else. Almost literally nothing else. They have some of our equipment. Because it can capture it, but... No more robots, so... Nice. Force it. Force it. Force them to die. Come on. Force them to die. They're literally, like, out of, like, guys. Literally out of robots at this point. Go in. Go in. Go in. Go in. Go in. Hit them harder. Because we have enough money, too, so... 
Uh, and we flush out everyone else here. Ah, uh, we could probably grab something here. I've already got military academy training. We have military academy officers now. We can do. I've never done this one. Mothball divisions? No. Lifetime pensions. More experience. More recruitable pop, uh, population factor. Max training. Caps expenses. Uh, we don't really need to do that one. And I don't want to do this one just because research speed's okay. And we're already done with researching stuff for the most part. And I don't want to hurt our political power too much. So, mm, how are we also doing here? Level five. Level two attack is just so bad. Go, just switch armies. Switch commanders. I don't care if it's in the middle of a battle or not. I really don't. I have this guy here. He'll be here in two weeks. He'll smash through these enemies probably pretty darn quickly. And now how many divisions I left? 104. 17,000 have died. <sighs> Just... We could do this so much faster if the Legion or uh, the Focus didn't kick us out of the, the Legion. It just makes no sense. It just makes no sense. Why? Actually, how are we doing here? Kaplan's looking pretty good, actually. 20, 80, come on, come on. Oh, he's almost here. He's almost here. Two days, two days. Get some more command power and force the attack a little bit more. Contact. Oh, come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Found the expedition. That's pretty normal. And where is New Vegas? Oh, we gotta do this again. Oh, that's fine. Alright, force it. Now we should be getting quite a bit more. Oh, they're doing less stand. Are they doing less stand? Maybe not. Look at that. Look how weak they are. And they're still putting up a good fight? How? We can pierce them, and they can't even pierce us. We have air superiority, too. Well, kind of. Actually, who's fighting first? I, was, eh, I think kind of pierce us a little bit, but, you know, whatever. Look at our general. Will faster. Looking so good. So good. And we still can't kill them all off? 17,000? Come on, man. How much more manpower do you have? 104 divisions. 9,000 people left. They're slowly mobilizing the leave a little bit more. That's so dumb. Yeah, I don't know, man. This is just... This, I think... It, I, wouldn't, I don't want to say it needs a rework. Because it doesn't necessarily need a rework. It just... When you get to this point, it's aggravating to just do this. Which I'm almost halfway done just like... Just to quit right now, but... I want to kill off New Vegas. New Vegas needs to die. It just has to die. I need to play New Vegas again sometime, though. Because look at all the equipment. Like, robots... Chariots. Robots, you know, chariots. I think they've definitely gotten a buff. They're definitely better than they used to be. It does help if you choose the right doctrine. Land doctrine, of course. But, hmm. What time is it? Oh, I've got a little bit of time. That's fine. I don't know. It's just... At least chariots are a little bit more usable right now. I don't know how they're... Actually, I'll be honest. I don't know how they're holding out with robots. Because they're out. They're literally out. There's nothing else they can do for robots. There's nothing else here. Coming back down here, guys. Hang out. And every time it says, like, if we're going to win, we're not going to, because we keep cycling in more soldiers. Can we please just win here? My god, just win, win, win. Go, go. Kill them off. Kill them off. I, that's why I even do force attack. Like, we get even more attack, more breakthrough, and stuff like that. But it's just not enough. It's just not enough. And the Legion isn't doing jack squat. You know, I'm going to be right back. Alright, so we're not really that far ahead of where we were just at, but like, this is taking forever, man. I'll be honest. Um, we've killed off, we've overran a couple of divisions, they've lost 22,000. If it wasn't for us, look at New Vegas. 14 divisions, and let me guess, doing last stand or something. They're not doing last stands for some of these divisions, but it's just, that's so extreme. Yeah, defenses are online though, but yeah, it's definitely extreme. I normally don't like doing like this, but if it just, if, I mean, if the Legion, if we weren't kicked out from the faction, we would have had this done. I can guarantee you we would have had, we've had, would have had this done by now. So, I mean, just, I don't know, but we've done we've done very very well here. You know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna take this line myself. Look at all that. We're just doing, we're just killing them all off. So I don't know. That took way too long, and I understand. It's like the whole kind of 300 thing with uh, you know, impassable terrain and stuff like that. But no, just this was too much, man. Ay ay ay. And of course, you have we have the AI as an ally, which was. Not great, not great. That's why I usually don't like playing minor nations, but sometimes, even though Rob Blues, you can do really, really well, but I'm going to take that because we deserve it because screw the Commonwealth. They kicked us out, but, and the other one kills. But that's where we're going to end today's campaign. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.